Want to use icons like me? Of course you do. Well, check out Use Them and Buy. It's the only place JD Gaming uses to ever buy his FIFA coins. It's fast, cheap, and reliable. Make sure you use JD for 6% off. Link in the description. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the video. Today we look at Jarzinho. Oh, do you remember this guy? Five foot eight, high high work rates, five star skills with a four star weak foot, right footed. El Fracon. Jarzinho. Now, this guy is probably. If you tell me, do you remember anything of FIFA 23? This is one name that's synonymous with FIFA 23. Using him last year, and I remember his mid card got an SBC, and I did it. ASAP because that card was ridiculous even pros were admitting he was the best winger in the game now this one you can use in ST as well as out wide he is an incredible icon Jerzinho where do we even begin with this card incredible pace incredible dribbling He's got the Travellers, his shooting is cracked. One thing I've always loved about Jairzinho is Jairzinho is very, very clinical. When I think about Brazilian icons, one of the big issues I've always had with Brazilian icons, I don't feel like they're that clinical. I'm really sorry to say that. From Pele, there was a problem when I was using Pele a couple of years ago. I didn't find him to be that clinical, especially his base version. Then Garincha, Garincha is amazing on the ball, but his finishing isn't all that. This is in previous installments of FIFA, not in this year. Now, there have been great, like even Ronaldinho, I found him to be like his base and his mid version previously in previous installments and iterations of FIFA. I didn't find him to be that clinical. Jairzinho, I've never had a problem with being with being a crazy finisher. This guy nets them at the back of the net. He makes it look so easy, and I think that's down to his shot power. He's got crazy power shots. And this is an incredible icon. Now, when I was talking about Pele and Garincha, that wasn't this FIFA. I can assure you this FIFA, they will be insane, right? Because there's only one icon version in the game. So, I'm interested. To see. But look at the dribbling. Look at the dribbling, ladies and gentlemen. Insane R1 dribbling with this card. Passing is sensational. Even strength. This card's really strong. I didn't want to see him get bullied off the ball. And I think it is fair to say this, but do you know whenever you see icon reviews, you need to be honest, you need to be you need to be real with the person. This guy is one of them type of cards that he's going to revolutionize your team, you know. He took me to the next division. I'm almost I mean, I'm almost in division 3 now thanks to Jairzinho himself. Like this is so this is a one man army. You can use him out wide if you like, but personally if I've got to look at the end of the day, you have got to be honest with yourself. If you've got an ST who's better than Jairzinho, then fair enough, play him out wide. But if your striker is not better than Jairzinho, then he has to play in the striker position because the striker position is is arguably the most important role in the game. It's all about scoring goals, right? And I think Jairzinho does that. So you can see how clinical he is from the video. Hardly ever missed. Just got that ball at the back of the net. He's got amazing finesse shots. His travellers are probably the be some of the best... Like, that is one thing I have to say. Every time I use a Traveller with him, it was going flying at the back of the net. Of course, this card is super juiced. It's super usable. I'm happy to give this card a 9.6 out of 10. And I'm going to be brutally honest right now. You know when the people say it doesn't matter, team doesn't matter? Honestly, I went from using Ian Rush and Trezeguet then to using Jairzinho. And the... Uh, the difference is huge, like team matters, it so does, this guy's got the breakaway speed, you don't need to be a rat and cross from the byline and you switch play every 10 seconds, you can just run through teams with this guy, you really can. I think I lost one game in 10 matches or something, honestly I really do, I just think he was just incredible, an insane icon a revolutionizing revolutionary icon someone's going to revolutionize your team someone who's going to make sure you get a dub someone who's going to make sure you win matches okay he's passing as well it's just just a flawless card i can't fault this card 9.6